Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Pickin' here. Why am I standing right here? Because I wanted to tell you that this box came right to my front door. Um, it got dropped off right to my front door. I ordered it. Um, it's from a company called AML Incorporated or palletbid.com. So you can get it from, uh, I think if you search Google both of those, you can get it AML Incorporated or palletbid.com. And um, this box was sent directly to my door. There's no sourcing, no gas money, none of that. Um, no time spent really other than just researching it online. So this is a box of mixed merchandise of health and beauty. Let me get my paper here. Health and beauty as well as other general merchandise. Okay, so anything that you would find in a major like drugstore retailer. So that's what's in this box. I spent um, $149.08, approximately $30 worth of shipping for a total of about 180 bucks on this. So we're gonna get it, dive into this box. Um, but I really wanted to share with you, I've been sharing a few other wholesalers and liquidation sites because it really takes a lot of the effort out of sourcing your materials when it comes directly to your front door. So let's get in this box and see what kind of condition we've got stuff in. Um, I. Um, when I purchased this, this is uh, considered shelf pulls. Um, if you purchase this, it's a shelf pull. Um, and so it's going to be probably in factory sealed condition. So that's going to be really good, um, especially for your buyers. You know it's going to be in really great condition. So it's packaged. looks like real nice and tight so stuff doesn't get jumbled around. It's going to be a variety of different things it looks like. So we'll get all this packing material out of here. And then we're just going to start walking our way through this and figuring out what's in here. So it looks like I've got some Maybelline uh, mascara. A couple of things of Maybelline mascara. Now, I am not ungated in the Maybelline category. I can sell in Health and Beauty, but not Maybelline. Um, and so those will probably go on eBay. Venus, these are really, really expensive. This is actually one, two, three razors. So that's probably right around the $8 to $15 range. At least I know when I'm in the store, that's how much they cost. I've got some Wicking Cool Comfort Fabric Socks. I've got Colgate um, Mouthwash. So just a variety. Um, Push Up Drama Maybelline Mascara. Uh, this is Garnier Whole Blends Coconut Oil Cocoa Butter Leave-In Conditioner. Let's see, Garnier Fructis Leave-In Spray. So kind of another leave-in conditioner. Tide Bleach. Let's see, we've got Pantene Pro V. Looks like conditioner, shampoo and conditioner in one. I'm gonna move this over so I can get everything on one side. There we go. Okay, I've got some more Garnier Fructis Curl Buttercream. Um, St. Ives Fresh, Fresh Scrub Apricot Scrub. Got some EOS, some more EOS. Good time of the year to get some chapstick. These are command damage free um, picture frame holders. I've got um, some more mascara. This is Rimmel. So I'll have to check and see if I can sell Rimmel. This is uh, more Maybelline eyelash mascara. These are Rimmel uh, BB cream foundations another one of those here's a Revlon nail polish now I know I won't be able to send in nail polish because nail polish is generally for the most part marked hazmat so you usually can't send it into the Amazon warehouse but listen just because I say you can't send it in the Amazon warehouse doesn't mean you can throw it up on eBay and sell it as well so go ahead and try that sharpie markers if I can't sell these I'm keeping them <laughs> um, this is Dickinson's original witch hazel deep puffing eye gel. So if you have puffy eyes, get yourself some witch hazel. Um, Revlon Kiss looks like lip balm. Oh, we've got some Cryomax cold pack. So it comes with its own little strap and you can strap it on yourself. One of those cold packs. Let's see, this is Baseboard Buddy. It's basically a Swiffer for your baseboards. What is this? Oh, these I've sold before, not this brand. 
um, but it's a blood pressure monitor. I have sold blood pressure monitors before and they usually sell really, really well. So this is an electronic blood pressure monitor. This is NYX um, Soft Matte Lip Cream. I've had really good luck selling NYX. Um, twin Pack of Off Family Spray. Now this I know for a fact I can't send into the warehouse because usually aerosol cans are um, automatically flagged as hazmat. So, but um, don't be discouraged. You may be able to sell it Merch Fulfill or you can sell it at a flea market, Facebook group, eBay, any of those avenues. All right, Dove Men Care. Let's see what else we got. We've got uh, Speed Setter Nail Polish. This is um, fake eyelashes. This is um, Miracle Gel Nail Polish. Dove Sensitive Skin no Nourishing Body Wash. That's a huge container. Um, we've got some L'Oreal Color Vibrancy Repair Mask. So it's like a mask cream. I've got Garnier Fructis Shampoo. So a lot of just everyday. The nice thing about this stuff is it's all usable items. And so this is something that if you got a big box of multiples of these, they would have to buy and buy and buy and buy and buy. Because this is all stuff that you use up and have to buy again. It's not a one-time purchase. Here's the conditioner that goes with that shampoo, which is neat because I could sell it as a lot if I so chose. Here's the same thing. Suave Honey Infusion. It looks like I've got shampoo and conditioner. So that's neat. So I can make lots. Let's see, we've got uh, L'Oreal Semi-Permanent Hair Color. So if you just want pink hair for a couple of days, there you go. And then I've got Clear Care Rinse and Go for contact solution. Here's some um, Sally Hansen Miracle Nail Polish. That's actually gel nail polish, which is a lot more expensive. So it's for the gel nails. This is a Pantene Pro-V conditioner. It'll go over here with the shampoo. So it looks like I've got a lot of sets, which is really awesome. Um, Shea Moisturize Detox Bubble Bath and Body Wash. Detoxing is a huge thing. And I don't know if you can see in this picture, but it's like light colored on the top and darker. And that's usually because they put that detox, um, I think it's like charcoal or something they put in the detox stuff. Correct me if I'm wrong, because I'm sure I make lots of mistakes. This is Curl Envy um, Gel. Here's some chapstick regular chapstick brand. Um, here is So Lashy uh, Mascara and it's a specialty brush. Looks like it goes, yep, the mascara fell out of the box. There you go. Now it's complete. All right, let's see. Um, Athos Mineral Cell, Cell Ox Shield. I don't, I'm not sure. It says S, it's sunscreen. It's a specialized sunscreen. Um, for your face, it looks like. Face sunscreen. So, Revlon Skinny Makeup. I've got some uh, Maybelline Foundations here. I got Neutrogena Age Fighter Moisturizer. Neutrogena is a high-end uh, moisturizer, and usually it's pretty expensive in the score store. Lumine Velo Arctic Berry Cocktail Hydrating Oil. I've got some Deep Woods Off. I've got Dora the Explorer Magic Pen with Painting. I mean, you usually see that in um, a lot of the, the uh, like Walgreens, CVS, and the other one, another coloring book. Um, hair color. So, I mean, just a little bit of everything. So obviously this is definitely a company I'd probably try to order from again, just because I got a variety of stuff. So I'd, I'll kind of go through this, find out what I can actually list and then go, okay, I want a box of just that kind of stuff. And that's something I think that they're accustomed to. I've called them before. They've got a couple of brick and mortar stores. Um, I think they're in the Alabama area. And so if you, um, live somewhere around there, look them up. It's uh, palettebid.com or, uh, AML, I think. Yeah, AML Incorporated. And so um, look up their brick and mortar places because then you'd save on shipping. This is a Vaseline healing cream, Windex wipes. Um, this is a spray, like a, for, like a Glade Febreze style of spray. Here's another one of those um, mascaras. Here is a Revlon 
uh, lip balm. Uh, here's a Rimmel Color Last Mascara. Here is Guess Girl. Looks like a perfume. I know perfumes you can't send into the Amazon warehouse, but you can um, ship them other ways. Revlon, you can sell on Facebook groups. Revlon lipsticks. Um, some CoverGirl nail polish. Here is Family Care Bite and Itch Relief. Here is a, another mascara from Rimmel. Here is a, <laughs> this is funny. Okay, can you zoom in on this one? CoverGirl Star Wars The Force Awakens lipstick. Every girl is not complete unless they have Star Wars The Force Awakens lipstick. So I wonder what color that even is. Looks like a purple. Alrighty. I've got um, Petal Plug. It's one of those electric fragrance diffusers. Tresemme Repair and Protect Instant Recovery Mask. Um, another one of these BB Cream Foundations. Let's see, two more things. CoverGirl Nail Polish again. Looks like same color, which is nice. Um, and then I've got a uh, lip liner. And this is from Exaggerate. Rimmel, Rimmel lip liner. So as you can see, I got quite a few items. I'm gonna try to do a breakdown of how much it is per item. And then, um, and obviously some things will cost a little bit more like because they weigh a little bit more, but um, I'll do a breakdown, let you know where I uh, come out as far as um, if I can make some money and what avenues I'm gonna sell each product. You know, like I said, there are a few things like the um, aerosol cans and things like that that I can't send into Amazon, but I can surely sell them on eBay and uh, Facebook groups and um, flea markets and things like that. So, um, and some of the things I may not wanna sell like the permanent markers I might wanna just keep for office supplies, but they have a variety of things. Um, they sell from a lot of different stores and they get liquidation wholesale Shelf pulls is what this is considered. Um, and this is a general merchandise health and beauty lot. So um, palettebid.com, AML Incorporated, you can look up both and be able to find where you can purchase it. But number one thing, number one reason why I got stuff from them comes right to the door. And so um, it saves me a lot of time. I hope this has been helpful and I hope it's a liquidation place that you will find useful for yourself. And remember in the end, Jesus wins.